Ready? Oh, hey, oh, welcome to Songs of Six. This game caught my attention, and there was a demo of it out. It's an early access base building game, but realistic, apparently. So I wanted to give it a try. I don't know what load means. Yeah, I don't have a game here. All right. Um, tutorial? Maybe. Is there a tutorial in the demo? Why did you kill my daughter? What? <laughs> All right. You have arrived on a new and promising land, but you can tame it and prove yourself a worthy, or can you tame it and prove yourself a worthy king? I wonder. In the end, you'll have to explore the game yourself or ask around the social channels online, but I'll try to guide you through the initial part. At your disposal are a few building materials and food. Make good use of them. All right. This is also the center of your city, the throne. There's still time to reap the harvest, or reap a harvest this year. Your immediate objective is to build a couple of farms. To find the farms, uh, INT, I think you mean just in, the bottom panel room menu. Okay, try building them near the water where fertility is high. To complete this task, you needed three farms of eight by eight tiles each, okay. Uh, they must be of an edible resource, fruit or vegetable. Hold up the mushroom, or hold up on the mushroom farm since they're built inside structures. Need some initial seeds for your farm, so inspect the piles in your throne room to get a sense of what farms you can build. Okay, may the god bless your cause, oh great one. I'm digging the music, oh dear, whoa. This is fucking weird. Is it like a pause? Is it spacebar? It's P. All right, I gotta figure out where the hell we are. What is this? Can I tell what this is? I don't know, there's so much shit. All right, well, that is indeed interesting. Um, What the hell is this? Status. Okay, I was looking for... Okay, so I got vegetables. And fruit. That's pretty great. Robert Redrum. Oh. Ooh. Alright, the visuals are a little lacking. But I like it. But this? Holy shit, this gives me like Dwarf Fortress vibes. Oh my god, this music is fantastic too. First day of spring, the first year of the first age. That's a lot of firsts. Cretonians. Cretonians excel at farming and thrive in temperate and warm climates, preferably close to water. They are vegetarians and prefer harmony and wood structures. Well, that's... interesting. Cantors are mythical giants. Okay, the few of them that remain are primarily focused... are primarily found in the north. They excel at most things, but are difficult to obtain and please. Weird. Dondorian? Sturdy and stubborn. Doesn't care much for farming, but excel at mining and refinement in their sturdy in battle. Okay? Oh my goodness. Ooh, there's a lot of things here. Vegetable farm. And I need an 8x8? Eight eight? Can I see where f fertility is? Fertility of the farmland. Right. Uh, over here? An 8x8. Eight eight. Fertility is 93. I think that's probably pretty good. Yeah. Alright. That's an 88, though. Uh. Undo? That's also an 88. All right. We're getting a little skimpy here with the, the fertility, but I dig it. That one's a 91. Why is this one sucky? Right, that's a 95. I'm gonna build that one. And then... How close do I need to be for this one to be good? 
All right, and then is there a quick button for normal speed? Two? All right. One is pause. I like that. Are these being built then? No? Swearing fealty. Well, I, that's cool, I guess. Um, do I have to do like one at a time? Reconstruct room. Yes? Uh, Alright, this is semi-intuitive. I'm gonna be honest, I'm just sitting here vibing to the fucking music. Oh, that is nice. Alright, so we have a vegetable farm there. Let's get a fruit farm set up. Now, is fertility different based on whether or not it's fruit or... No, because that's still an 84. Alright, fruit farm. And then I need one more. Why do I keep clicking on that one? Perfect. Alright, now if I hit play, they should go and build things? I think? When they're not f swearing fealty? Walking to job site. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I like this. Uh, I should probably also have them fell some trees. You know, for lumber and whatnot. I wish I could, like, hover over things and it'd be like, oh, it's this type of terrain. Uh, I could clear rocks. Clear rocks on the map. Yields the resource stone. Okay. Dig canal? Dig into mountain? Utify cave walls. This is dwarf fortress. That's all this is. I'm intrigued. I, why is it snowing in spring? I don't like this. This upsets me. Oh, workforce. I have ten idle. Uh, I don't like that. I wonder if it means... Oh, crack my knuckles. I wonder if it means that... Idle is just like... Uh, set the work priority of rooms according to species? Interesting. I wonder if that just means that, like, the idle are builders. There's a lot of fucking things, by the way. Like, look at all this. Jesus. Bathhouse, chambers, dormitories, flat houses, graveyards, libraries, scaffolding, dungeons, guard posts, kitchens, feast halls, taverns, weaponsmith, toolsmith, tailors. <gasps> no, I'm not reading all that. Holy fuck. Oh, you all gonna go work on the, the farms now? Cool. I don't know why you weren't doing that before, but yeah. Your seat of power. Don't lose it and don't cut it off from your citizens. Great. Who now is the response when asked about you and the surrounding villages and towns? Even the farmers just a few miles from town don't know you. That's great. Squire. Let's see. Okay. Cool. Faction name. Coder... Coder... Right. I could change all that if I wanted to. That was terrifying. I don't know if I like that saving world screen, but I get it. Yes. Do the farm things. I guess I'm just gonna fast forward, like, really heavily. Alright, one of these is done, right? No, it hasn't been constructed yet. Probably. Now it's nighttime. Off time, I see. Oh, holy fuck, that's loud. Wait, where was I? Down here. There's like lightning and shit. I dislike this. Uh, can I build, like, houses? So probably just like the, the wooden? A combination of utility of ceiling and surround... Any? I don't know how to build shit. <laughs> Hopefully you guys aren't too upset by the fact that you didn't really sleep last night. Maybe it's giving me a bit of leeway, because now we're on, what, day three? It's 
sleeping off time. Ah. People just kind of sleeping wherever. Yeah, kinda. Oh, look at that. Yeah, they are. Oh, I like that. What are, you, are you swimming? Skinny dipping. Henry Hams is skinny dipping. I'm favoriting you. You amuse me. Uh, no workers assigned. No storage for produce. Right. Um. I think I just need to wait for them to get to it. Um. When you set the target unplayed, we'll soon sign up and start working the room. Without sufficient workers, the room will perform poorly. Okay. Well, I th think that's enough. What about. I don't know if it needs more than one. I also need to make a storage, I think. Woodcutter coal mine. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna assume the warehouse. What's a hauler? Fetches a certain resource and hauls it to a location. Haulers are free to construct, but must be placed on clear ground. Interesting. Uh, I'm assuming a warehouse? I don't know where I want to put that, though. Like, right, right over here? What if I just do, like, an 8x8 warehouse? That's gonna cost a lot of wood. And stone. I don't know if I have stone. I'm gonna try and construct it. Oh, it has insufficient resources. Well, for shame. Okay, interesting. Crates for storage of goods. I see. Can I, like, rotate? Rotate is R. Okay, alright. I don't know if that works like that. Um, like, like so. I feel like this is a lot of, a lot of weed that I'm using up that I maybe don't need to. What about now, okay. Now I can construct it. That was a bit strange, but I got it. It's uh, not the most intuitive, but I'm getting it. I believe. I kind of like that it auto-assigns the employees. Alright. Yes. Very good. Your settlers will now automatically assign themselves as farmers. Yep. If you find yourself short on food, you can also make a hunter or two and manually collect wild stuff during the summer. Okay. Uh, now we need storage for the coming harvest. It's time to build a warehouse. Make the room around 7x7. Seven seven. God damn it. And be careful not to overspend your resources. Right. Mm. <laughs> I I did it too fast. No. Oh. Well, I guess I'll make another one. Alright, there we go. I'm making another one. Oof. Oh, these... Every, wait a minute. <laughs> Oof. It's a very short... Time frames here. Anyway, uh... Can I assign this? How do I... Is this not done? Oh, it's not fully constructed, I see. Maybe I don't have enough wood. Alright. Gee, that delivery man will sure come in handy. Now let's make sure we have storage for basic raw materials such as wood and stone. Uh, uh, yes? Oh, I see, I see. Okay, so you can do... One of each, so I need... Alright, well, we're still working on building this thing, but I'm not... Sure what comes next? This is taking a while. But again, I kind of fucked up, so... It'd be what it'd be, yeah? I've also assigned all of the crates in here to veggies and fruit, which is fantastic. Oh shit, we're already on the first day of autumn. Jesus. Ah. Yes, build this better so that I can <laughs> uh, get on to the tutorial more. Takes them a long time to build things, but I guess that's you know, 
logical. I'm kind of getting low on the amount of idle people I got, which spooky. All right, so now I got to assign. What was the fucking thing you wanted me to do? Wooden stone. Great. There's also damn it. Uh, I need to assign two crates to each of the following. So I need two crates aside to grain. All right. All right. I don't really seem to check off that one, but now I need wooden stone. One crate for wooden, one for stone, I assume is what that means. All right, success. Now you've got the basics set up. I could probably survive the winter. To get more wood and stone, you can manually select trees and stone to be harvested, or you can put down wood cutters and stone cutters to do so automatically. Next up, you should build a small carpenter, which will allow you to build furniture in more complex rooms. Keep expanding and exploring the map, but be sure to order 25 to 50 percent of your population into the food business to ensure you won't starve. Best of luck and thanks for playing. That's the tutorial. Oh shit, I'm screwed. Workload. How busy the employees are. If the workload is low, it means some of the workers have nothing to do and are wasting their time. If the workload is 100%, your workers might have too much to do. I see. So the farms seem to be fine with one worker. Uh, right. Okay. It said it wanted me to make a carpenter now? I could probably do that. Industry, I would assume? Carpenter. Oh dear. Um. Maybe down towards this area? You know where all the wood is? I don't know what size the carpenter should be. Also, what is the efficiency here? The, the standard thing seems to be like an 8x8, eight eight, so... Uh... I'm going to assume that that's the thing, and then I need a... Workbench. Oh dear. Uh... Rotate. Seems fine. And then adds efficiency to the room. Yeah, sure. Hell yeah. 100% efficiency. It would need uh, three workers, though. Hmm. What if I... No, that doesn't change the amount of workers. Does the... Size... Of... How do I shrink? Oh, well, that... Didn't help me. I gotta get used to the controls. This squeeze me. Isolation prevents room from degrading and the sound of pollu- oh, okay, and sound pollution achieved by surrounding rooms with walls and a few doorways. Grand? I changed the size of it. Does that change the amount of workers necessary? No, it does not. Okay. We'll go with the 8x8 eight eight, then. With the workbench... I don't know why, but I like it there. And then, whatever that auxiliary station was, I guess I'll put it nearby. I don't know. Right, okay. And then, it's got walls, so I just need some doors. And that should be good. It requires some stone and lots of wood, though. Okay. Sure, let's get working on that. I think they said I should theoretically be able to survive, so stop repeat. Oh my god, there's a goddamn tome of knowledge. Can you search shit? Sad. That's not what I meant to type, but. <laughs> I just wanted to type random things and I hit sad. Okay. Uh, Ox is a stubborn beast, but it's left its grace. Jesus. Fishes. Monument? Farming, hunters, oh dear. Carves furniture out of wood. Furniture is a secondary resource produced by carpenters from wood. Primary resource furniture is needed in various rooms that produce other things, as it is where workbenches, workstations, chairs, and other items from other workshops are made by your diligent workers. Furniture is a resource also used in dormitories. The resources needed both to construct but also to maintain most rooms. Oh dear.
Prisons? Courts? There's laws? Oh. I'm so interested and so intrigued by this. This is just a demo, by the way. Um, I, I think they said the demo has all of the content or most of it, but wow, there's a lot of shit to this. Smilodons, uh oh. Yeah, those are the, the big, uh, I like that. I could use some like, some pictures would be nice. But, I get that it's a work in progress. Oh, you can see what, uh... So, spring they clear weeds, summer they tend, autumn they harvest, and there's nothing to do with farms in the winter. This means that a farmer isn't very busy during the spring and winter and is available for other chores. Farmers are best placed on the ground with high fertility, or farms are. Yep. Oh boy. I was gonna look at something. What the fuck was I gonna look at in here? Bathhouse? Uh, yeah, that's great and all. There's so much shit. <laughs> it's just, oh, it's just so much shit. Build this. Oh yeah, you can see the degrade percentage. Nice. How are we doing on food? Can I see my stocks? Yeah, there we go. Or my stores. This is very nice. It seems like we still have plenty of wood sitting around, so I'm not necessarily worried about that at the moment. And I th think we're doing okay on food? Kind of? We have a lot of fruit. So that's cool. And it is autumn, so I assume everybody's still harvesting things? Is that what you're doing? You're farming. Well, so this tells me nothing. I'm sure you're farming, dude. You're working at the farm. <laughs> like, oh, no shit. Alright, so... You don't have- none of these guys have, like, beds or anything, so they've just been sleeping on the fucking ground. By the way, the game, the tutorial, didn't even tell me how to make houses, so we're in a great spot. Ah, I see. So flat or subject sleep, improved sleep quality. Oh, I need fucking things. God damn it. Uh, dormitory. Simple way of providing your subjects with a place to sleep. And this requires. Yeah, so I can't even make this shit yet because I need the carpenter to be up. Solid. Build my subjects. Food stores in days. 20? Oh, I like that. That's a nice quality of life thing. Assuming that's displaying what I think it means, where I have 20 days worth of food. Yeah, that's definitely what that is. Okay. Uh, it is now winter? Yeah. Great. Are you telling me you guys didn't already harvest? I'm adding one more farmer to each because I just want to know if that'll improve the production at all? How goes the carpenter? Still not built. I need to assign a carpenter. I have no free people, unless... Did you already... You assigned two employees already, didn't you? Yes, okay. And then, do you- do I have to queue stuff up, or holy shit, what is wrong with your face? And you guys are fucking ugly. I thought I was ugly. I'm so sorry, <laughs> that's so mean. I guess they just automatically are going to produce furniture. Oh, so it's not like you make a bed or you make a thing, right? It just kind of like auto-produces furniture? Very neat. No storage for furniture. Yes. Yes, of course. Uh... There we go. Now you have one storage for furniture. I still have three crates free, so that's pretty solid. Wow. These fuckers are really happy. They're just... I guess double click to grant access to all immigrants. I don't know 
what the fuck that means. Oh, were there three people? Oh, is that plus one more workers that I can grab? Yes. Oh, now we got a Dondorian somewhere. How do I... Yeah, oh wow, it like goes directly to them. Uh... You. Swearing fealty, yes, yes, I like that. What, what the hell is this? Why are you upset? Are you under attack? I have several questions. Are you mad? You're a glutton and a sprinter. Oh, that's cool. Man, this fucker had to go through the whole goddamn map to get to me. Is that why you're very not happy? Alright. Are you? Oh, you're a carpenter. Cool. Well, there we go. No, I don't think I'm gonna grab any more of those. I will grab... No, because we're down to 10 days of food now, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a little little woggy here with that. Still only 20 workload. I might be able to just make more farms. I think I'm gonna try and make another farm. Gotta remember, I can also do hunters, fisheries. Catch just fish along the shorelines. Uh, do I build it in the fucking water, or... What if I build, like, an 8x8 eight eight there? Fishery construction. Okay, it doesn't look like there's a thing that I really need here. Uh like 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 Okay, well I dig I dig the storage, but I don't know if that's where I want that. What about here? Max amount of this item is reached. Well that's terrible. Uh yeah, put a bunch of whatever the hell these are down. I add more than 100% of efficiency. No. Alright. Well, there you go. Fishery. Fantastic. Which also means that I'm gonna need to change one of these to fishies. Fantastic. I'm having a lot of fun with this. Although, I could definitely see that this is... What's up here? Uh, this job needs a resource that's unattainable in your city before it can be... Oh, what does it need? I wish it told me. Uh, it just needs stone and wood, right? I have no idea. Adopt a cat! Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know what the material is that we don't have. Are you telling me that we don't have enough wood? That is indeed possible. I don't know what the, um... What's the word I'm trying to use here? I don't know how fast trees grow back, so I'm a little concerned about chopping down too many, but I think we'll be fine. Looks like we also survived our first winter, which is pretty solid. Nice. I think I'm gonna side just two for now, and then I wanna see how well that does. That's a 13% workload. What if I go down one? Well, either way, we're getting fish. That's solid. More things to do. Uh, I should be able to make a dormitory thing now, right? I... Don't know. Increases the available beds. Do I want to just make, like, a thick boy? Or do I just want to keep doing, like, 8 by 8s might start off with an 8x8. Eight eight. Let's get some walls on that. And, uh, my standard, like, double door scenario here. Nah, this has to be a 9x9 nine nine or I'm gonna lose my shit. Alright, and then, like, this. Much better. And then... We reverse that. Cool. And then can I fit... So what, that's... 10 beds. Knickknacks. Adds coziness to the room. Must not block other item. I see. Oh, man. Yeah, this is definitely gonna need to be bigger. Okay. Well, I'm glad I figured this out. 
I still also don't know where I want it, which is an issue for me, but... What about a 12 by 12? Is that too large? It's gonna take a fuckload of wood, though, is the issue. How much furniture do we have currently? Six? Ugh. All right, so that's enough for everybody currently. This is gonna take fucking forever. Um, I don't know what it means by knickknacks, but I'm gonna put like knickknacks near. Okay, I don't need that many. Good to know. Uh, put a few in the center here. I don't know what knickknacks are, but I have a few of them. <laughs> Oh god, this is gonna take forever. Alright, well. Let's get started on that, shall we? And then also, I'm probably gonna need to cut down something. Uh, let's keep an eye on these. These seem to be doing well. I need to keep an eye on the uh, daily progress and make sure that there's enough workers in these, I think. Who the fuck is skinny dipping? Jesus. Are they already done? Key. I'm gonna go with, I think, only one of you is necessary. What else? What time is it? It's spring. They're definitely gonna need another worker in summer, though, right? Actually, it doesn't even look like I need two of them in the summer, either. Okay. Maybe if I get some bigger-ass farms, but for now, it looks like an 8x8 farm only needs one employee, which is solid. Also, this guy is not very happy. Which I guess is understandable. Doesn't care much for farming, but excels at mining and refinement. Yeah, I don't, I don't think grabbing you is a great idea. My apologies. Our subjects are trained into soldiers. I would like to train that one guy up, but that's gonna take a lot. And I don't even think I have whatever the hell that other thing is that I need. Uh, I don't think I need to build a graveyard yet. Where subjects do their dirty deeds of need. The <laughs> Laboratory. I like it. Uh, library? Where knowledge is stored and maintained. Fascinating. Now we got an ore mine, a stone mine. I should probably get a woodcutter. I don't know what the hell that other thing is that's necessary. What is this? Metal. Oh dear. That's optional. Okay. I don't know what these fucking squares are. Oh, that's nice though. Show wild edibles. Oh, I don't give a fuck. Mineable resources? Eh, uh, oh. That's very far away. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I'm starting to understand how the woodcutter's construction works. It's like, it needs to be near trees, but also not? Because you need room for other shit. The amount of workers that can be in place, as long as it doesn't, like, use up all of them. And then storage... What's that say? We're fisher... That's not... That's not the right thing, buddy. Alright, what about like that? Maybe... Maybe that's a bit better? It doesn't really change the amount of workers, but... Makes less space necessary. And then, uh, do these take the metal? They do. I don't have metal yet, so... We're at a very low efficiency. Uh, I'm gonna not do that yet, then. Alright, what one of these is ore? This is ore. Okay. Uh, that's gonna be very far away is the only issue. But if I put it here... Output! Yes. Perfect. Alright. <laughs> 45 workers. Nah, think of good thing. <laughs> Jesus, what am I doing? Like a one by one here? What are we doing here? 18. Uh... No? I don't know if I need a mine yet. Maybe I should put some of this that isn't on the, uh... <laughs> I got I'm figuring it out. 
There we go, there's the goddamn storage. And then I assume this requires metal that I don't want to use. Yes, all right, we'll build those at a later point. Because I assume I'm gonna need ore eventually. So let's get that constructed, I guess. I'm still trying to figure out what I'm doing, man. I think up this way, that is coal, I think. I don't know, man. Found some wild edibles that I'm gonna grab, too. Hell yeah. I grabbed a couple more of these guys. I'm actually gonna grab another one, too. The issue is I need to be careful out of food, so I'm not gonna grab anybody else yet. And I think I need to set up another farm or two. That's gonna have to wait. You know, I think that's probably a good spot to conclude this one. I really like this. Like, a lot. But, you guys also let me know what you think, if you're interested in more or not. This is just the demo, so I don't know how long I can continue it, but I'm digging this. This is really cool. It's very simple graphically, but the mechanics are fucking great. So, yeah. Peace out all that shit.